सो लेट्स टॉक अबाउट द थिंग्स दैट वी कैन डू टू अवॉइड दीज थिंग्स एस आई नॉट इज स्मॉल थिंग इन टेलीग्राम एंड आई एम श्योर विथ व्हाट्सएप ऑल्सो देर आर सेटिंग्स प्राइवेसी सेटिंग्स दैट अलविंग नो बडी टू मैसेज यू एक्सेप्ट द पर्सन ओनली ऑन योर कंटेंट please turn that on because uh, in telegram uh, if someone is not having your mobile number they can just put your username or guess your username and put a message to you so you can even block that also in whatsapp um, i think they have that option also uh, for mobile numbers i'm not sure about that but there are certain privacy uh, features allowed in those popular messaging apps because the these scams and everything are not common in sri lanka but all over the world there are certain things you know all over the world so these technology companies these uh, companies are implementing ways that we can avoid these things please enable those settings uh what else maja what else we can do to avoid these things um one more thing is that we can be aware of those stuff right because uh, initially like most of the time i think uh, you me and other people we we receive those type of scams right every day um but uh, ओबटेटो <laughs> group and this particular person is conducting a scam so they will take a spectrum to you know prevent that type of things happening in the future as well so um one of the thing another thing is that we can actually be aware of uh, things and the uh, offers that we are receiving which is too good to be true so please re- refrain from those you know engaging those type of messages as well because sometimes uh they might be getting our contact details emails mobile numbers from scraping the internet and sometimes our private uh, our emails and mobile numbers must be laying somewhere around uh, you know in dark web or something like that so what they do is initially they just send text messages or email just to uh, they don't know whether this type of uh, the, this number or email address is available or is is it active or not but what they do is they just send uh for the sake of sending so after that if they receive a uh, you know response from that particular victim then they will start knowing in so don't respond to any type of those kind of scam it might be a phishing attempt or it's, it's, it might be a ponzi scheme or a pyramid scheme as well so uh, don't respond report it and if you have been a victim and now you have learned the lesson just make sure to spread the awareness tell the other people that you have been a victim of this type of a scheme and yeah that way you can you know refrain from happening something like that from the future as well basic thing to avoid these things is uh, i think much on presence of mind yeah if you see like a famous logo let's say you know google logo right you know youtube logo right so if certain person are saying google is paying this much amount for this much of task you should have awareness that okay this is google they don't have to do this like you have to have a really good common sense actually be present in the scenario like don't let your greedy factors get into your ways yeah that's the first thing second thing i think majang you should all we everyone should be aware of the tools that we are using the capabilities of the tools that we are using mm-hmm. the features that uh, these tools are having for let's say for that uh, this exact reason i got a message because i am uh, i have already enabled uh, anyone can message me in telegram so that's the reason that i got those certain messages uh, successfully i was able to <laughs> find the chat that i was participated in <laughs> hopefully i will put the screenshots you will be getting an idea about how these things will play out yeah uh, as per those messages they are willing to pay up to 10000 to 15000 per day so it's a really convincing amount of money <laughs> again uh, about the tools you guys are using be aware of the companies organizations that those tools are built on 
let's say meta google they are be presence with the security breaching and everything and a major thing in sri lanka there are no uh, like privacy related uh, implementation happen in any organization yeah yeah period you own your mobile number but you don't actually own your mobile number uh, it's owned by the telco provider they can do whatever with your mobile number they can share your mobile number with whatever person they want that's why you are getting uh, messages like athe mudal no mathida avrudu ivarai mudal ivarai ikman loan ekak ganna those sort of messages are you will be receiving because those organizations doesn't have very good practices coming to your personal data actually mobile phone number you uh, i paid 150 rupees for my mobile number but i don't own that yeah that's really messed up in my opinion uh, also for a username in your social network if you put a username that should be unique right so why the unique username you put into is not owned by you they can change that they can share those, those information with, with everyone that's these are the main reasons that we are getting to the people are getting into these troubles yeah. so be aware of the technology that you're using uh, the capabilities of those technologies kanchka i found that you put a not on the setting that exact whatsapp setting that you need to be disabled to avoid these things uh, i'll mention it it's in the settings privacy groups contacts only so only your contacts can add you to another group no one else so it will uh, reduce significantly reduce the things if your contact one of your contact is adding you to certain kind of this kind of this kind of group just block him yeah yeah to be in touch with those people know your technologies know your tools Uh, those are tools right you have to use these to get certain things done not to be um, consumed by those tools that are really huge thing i believe in that's it masha right any other thing that we miss um 